towards the end of 2021, I began working on a YM2151 sound card for the RC2014. Uh, this video is just going to be a quick update of where I've got to with that sound card. The YM2151 is a FM synthesis IC Yamaha brought out in the 80s, which was featured in the Sharp X68000 computer, uh, Yamaha's SFG sound add-on for the MSX, and it was also on quite a few arcade PCBs as well. It's also very similar to the IC that was in the DX21, DX27 and DX100 Yamaha synthesizers, although not completely identical. So the YM2151 can generate up to eight notes simultaneously. It's a four operator FM synthesizer and it has uh, eight possible algorithms that you can choose from. So this gives you quite a bit of flexibility. So I've created a revision one PCB. Yeah, and this has generally worked quite well. Although I did make one omission in that I didn't wire up the interrupt pin uh, from the YM2151. Um, we'll see why that's an issue a bit later on when I demonstrate the board. There's a few of the bits that I'm not entirely happy with. Uh, I made the font on the silk screen too small, so this didn't come out too well on the uh, on the real board. But yeah, let's get into a bit of a demo. So so far, I've got two kinds of music files playing back on the board. Um, firstly, I've got um, MDX files from the Sharp uh, 68000 playing back. So someone developed a um, Arduino shield with the YM2151 on. Um, I've taken the code from the Arduino sketch and ported it to the Z88 DKC compiler in the RC2014 and got that working here. But the timing's off at the moment and I need to incorporate interrupt support both from a hardware point of view on the board and the software to support that. Uh, the second kind of files I've got playing back are uh, VGM files. Um, so JB Langston, in his repository that goes along with his sound card, he'd got this VGM player, uh, which supports playing back SN76489 VGMs. Marco McAfeary enhanced that to also play back uh, AY uh, VGMs. So I've taken that and also added the ability to play back um, OPM VGMs as well. So we've got MDX files, VGMs, so yeah, so the Commander uh, Commander X16 computer that is planned to have a YM2151 on. So yeah, so there was this ex example of how to play back a beep sound from BASIC. So I've also ported that as well. Cool, I'll now give uh, these a demonstration. So if we start BASIC. Uh, so let me paste in this BASIC program. So if we run this, we should get a simple beep noise. Cool. Okay, so let's go on to the, um, the more advanced examples. Let's try the uh, MDX files. So here you'll see the problem that I've got in that um, the timing is off. This is a CPM com file that we're running via the Z80 control. So I won't play this for too long, um, but you'll get an idea of um, the fact that the timing's a bit off. It's not supposed to play with this tempo. So now you can see how the complexity of the music's um, decreased. It's playing a lot faster. So let's just end that there. And then for the final example, let's play back some uh, VGM files. Um, so the problem with VGM files is they're quite large, and the VGM player currently loads the entire file into memory. Um, so I need to do some work to um, 
stream them from the file system so we can play back larger VGMs. Let's try another one. Well, I hope this has given you a flavour for the uh, sound card. And I hope that um, in the future um, I'll be able to produce a new version. And once that's done, I'll re release the designs as open hardware so anyone can get a board made. Thanks for watching.